Hello everyone, this is Care. In our previous tutorials, we have covered many interesting video effects. And today, I will show you how to create this type of split screen effect. You can easily and quickly achieve the effects in the video by following the tutorial. If you are interested in this one, keep watching the video. First, let's open video blogger. If you haven't downloaded it yet, use the link in the description box below to free download the software. Next, we import the prepared video clips and music into video blogger. Now, let's start designing the composition of the screen. For example, let's first design the layout with the two quadrants. You can drag with the left mouse button here to create the two guidelines and place them in the center of the screen. You can feel the guidelines being automatically selected when the mouse is near the center. Next, click here to create several overlay tracks. Then, place the material one to position in the top left corner of the screen onto the overlay track. Next, move the material to the top left corner. You can see that the material just fills the area outlined by the guidelines. This is because our video aspect ratio is 1920 by 1080, and the video material is also 1920 by 1080. Both video ratios are 16 to 9, so they can be resized to exactly one quarter after shrinking. Next, Place the second video material onto the overlay track below. Move it to the top right corner position. You can see that the area defined by the video and guidelines does not overlap completely this time. Because this video has a ratio of 2048 by 1080, which is inconsistent with 16 to line. So it cannot be perfectly aligned. But don't worry. We just need to place it at the top of the video and drag this dial down like this until it just fills the upper right corner of the screen. These production methods for the other two areas are the same. Let me quickly make them here. After completing the four screens, we need to start adding animation effects to them. We selected this material, find a fit and move in the inspector. The screen is in the upper left corner of the screen, and I hope it entered from the upper left corner, so we can choose this entering fact. Let's play and see. Well, not bad. Here we change the duration to 0.5. Then select the screen in the upper right corner, and choose this entering fact from the upper right corner, and change the duration to 0.5 as well. The following two screens also select the corresponding entry fact. Then, adjust the start time of the materials in order to create a sequential entry fact. Now click play to see the effect. Well, not bad. Next, for convenience, we can move all four materials to the same overlay track. and then start creating the second split screen effect. Let me quickly do it here. Now, let's create a new split screen effect, a dead angle split. We place the material on the new overlay track, and then find transform in the inspector. Select a line by Y, then change rotation to 29. Let's move the material position to a diagonal. You can see that the material does not completely cover the area we lead. We just need to select this small dot and then drag it to enlarge and move it. After adjusting the position size, we go back to a fade and move. 
the material in the lower left corner and choose this effect. Well, the same operation on the other side. Let me do it quickly here. After finishing, let's add a new material. This time we change to a different diagonal. Because the angle has just changed, we need to change the rotation to 331. Then adjust the zoom and position to fit. If you can adjust it to a desired position, you can try clicking X and Y parameters here to fine tune the position. After all the adjustments, we put music on the music track and place the materials according to a rhythm. Let's see the final result. Well, not bad. That's it for today's video. If you want to know more about the other tricks or what has been going on with Vinipo Vlogger, be sure to click that subscribe button to subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet. And we'll see you soon in your next video. Hope you enjoy. Bye bye!